Hey Savivas, this is Super Summer Cup Barbecue, and today, WWE Champions is back. Not just back, they're back with a bang. Bang! Golden Blitz is on, and not only that, but DDP's on the front page. This guy literally made my last Golden Blitz. He was amazing. If you haven't seen that, go check it out. DDP is the man, not just a double gold star. More about double gold stars in a bit, but... That Silver Star DDP though, oh, he, he's, a, he's a good lad. He helped me very, very, very much. And there is the Beast Incarnate, the latest three-star superstar, which unfortunately you need either him or a, another really, really, really powerful uh, three-star superstar to do Hell Mode in this Gauntlet Blitz, which I don't have. But I have been doing the Hard Mode to get myself some awards. You know what, a thousand double star coins isn't too bad, and we're gonna get ourselves a premium superstar pack out of it anyway. So, given the Brock Lesnar's the card, you gotta do one thing for me, and that is to hit a huge F5 on the like button. If you can pick it up, spin it around as fast as you can, and hit it on the ground. Maybe do it more than three times. In fact, four times. In fact, this, I actually realized something the other day. At WrestleMania, The Undertaker took three F5s and got pinned. Roman Reigns took four, and didn't get pinned. Bruh. Anyway, facts out of the way. Hit the like button if you like what you see. And let's get into this right now. And obviously don't forget to subscribe as well. We're going to face Edge now. Uh, I cannot wait because I really like his superstar image on this. As well as Christian as well. Let me know in the comments section below if you've been playing Golden Blitz this weekend. I have been loving it. Uh, I played it through twice this time. And both on hard mode with this team. They're not crazily overpowered. 859 Seth Rollins, um, 859 Ziggler, I've been using Kalisto, although I'd prefer to use double silver stars a little bit lower, a little bit more on level with Papa Ray Dudley, uh, Dolph Ziggler, and two Dolph Ziggers. Is that Zigception right now? D how is this possible? And then right back at the top, he's got 8% life left, he's going to die out really soon. I've got a very short amount of life with Ryback, so I'm going to hopefully do as much damage to Edge as possible. Edge and Christian came into the game last week, really happy to see them in the game, while I preferred his Rated R Superstar gimmick to his Edge and Christian gimmick. You know what, I'm not going to complain too much. Get two free lines, nice. Sorry, free lines, it's been a long time since I did that. Free lines. And he got himself some blues there, so that's going to charge up his finisher. What can we do here? What is possible here? We're going to use... We've got some blacks over there, or we've got some crates. We're going to use... Uh, actually, two there. We're going to get two. We're going to go for a pin with 528. Really? Really, right back? Really? That's not going to work. Okay, so we're now in the danger zone. We're now in the danger zone. Uh, ooh, this is going to be interesting. Got some greens over there. I didn't really want to use any greens. I don't want to use any of my props. So, I could take a chance. No. But it's going to go with this. It, it, was a, it was a wrong chance to take anyway. You can see there that there was nothing left on the board for him to go for. So, he just reshuffled. Big boot! I've got loads of that Mr. Fuji, the shuffle board stuff. That might help me in this battle, actually, because I've got loads of those props. And it's really, really, really useful. I want to take as much damage. I'm not bothered if I don't manage to finish this with Ryback. But I'd prefer to do as much damage as possible to him. And Ryback's moves are really, really powerful in this. So that makes a big, big difference. Uh, da, 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 right. I've got some reds. I've got some purples. I'm going to go for the purples. It's going to do something to him. Um, hopefully he doesn't use the blues. Which I just made available for him. Yes, he does. There. Ah, yeah, he's now going to go for the spear. It's spear time. Oh, j damn, Jesus Christ. How many points do you want? He's not going to go for the spear. I don't even know what that was. Uh, but, yeah. We're going to lose. I'm not bothered. Yeah, I did as much damage as I could. Uh, right back is gone. We've got one half of Zigception. Uh, we're going to... Ooh, blues, blues. I've got reds here. I've got a line of reds. Let's take as much... There we can. There we go. Okay, that's good. We took as much off as we possibly could. And this is going to go very well for us if we can keep doing this. Another line there. More reds as well. Two or three lines there. And that might be a pin. Is that a pin? We'll find out very soon. It is a pin. We just beat an edge. We took literally no damage at all. How awesome is that? And we're going to get loads of loot off the back of it as well. Not quite enough. Freestyle victory. And that's another pack I can open. 
which might get me something decent. The next match we're going to have is for 10,000 coins. I need them. We're going to go up against... We're going to go up against The Undertaker. I didn't realize The Undertaker was in this. That's really good for me because I've been using Dolph Ziggler because Dolph Ziggler is going to be able to kick The Undertaker's ass. The question is, is do I use Dolph Ziggler or do I go and use Kalisto? I'm going to use Dolph Ziggler because if he loses, he's going to at least take a lot of damage off of The Undertaker. It's all about using your head. It's all about using your head. I am going to use the blues here. Probably the best thing I can do at the moment. I'm in no rush to beat The Undertaker. That's, that's all I was going to say. Okay. Purples. There we go. Let's use purples. Two lines taken out. Three lines taken out. Damn. We might get a pin here. 2,782 damage. No, it's not likely. Unlikely. Yeah, he kicked out straight away. What was I thinking saying he was going to get a pin there? Uh, right, so... Ooh, three random gems into red gems. I don't need that right now. So I am going to do the strategic plan. And I'm going to go with both of those two lines. It does a bit of damage to me. That means I'm going to have a finisher up though. So, tell you what. I'm going to use the running corner splash. I'm going to hope for some reds here. Yep, there we go. Okay, so set of reds as well there. Which means we can use this to do more damage. And maybe, maybe go for a pin. This one, this one. Uh, you'll see why I'm using these in a second. You'll see why I'm using these in a second. I'm hoping... Is there another one I can use? Is there another one? Mm, I don't think so. So you know what? I'm just going to just destroy that one as well. Okay, that's good. Okay, and then we're going to see here is the reason why I did that. Because this destroys three random heal gems. There's only three of those heal gems on the board. So this is going to cause so much damage. Taker is going down. He's going down, baby. There we go. Boom! That's taking out two or three lines and the rest. Oh, this might not be enough. Are you kidding me right now? What the hell? He just kicked out. How did he kick out too? Why won't you stay down? Oh, that's annoying. Okay, fine. Um, you know what? I'm going to go for the Fuji special. I'm just going to try and shuffle some gems on the board. Because I need something. There's one set. Two sets. Three sets. Four sets. There we go. That's more like it. Not going to get a pin, though, because he's got OP power. Well, actually, might. Ah, oh, you lucky. Again. Just did it again. So easily out of it. It's like he literally just... It's like, yeah, I'm just going to kick out. It's okay. You could just, you could have hit me with like, the, the hardest finisher in the world. I still would have kicked out. Right. I kind of have no choice here. I kind of have to use the, uh, the four row there. Just to get something on him. Because he's going to use his finish in the next go. Right, okay, fine. So we can use... We're going to use the rapid elbow drops for this one. And see how that gets us. How far that gets us. Level 6 of it might do a lot of damage. 3,601. Uh, yeah, I, I'm done. I'm done. And I'll still be able to go into the next game. So you know what? I'm just going to... I'm just going to tap out of this one. I'm just going to get out because... I'll be able to beat him in the next game, no problem at all. It's not an issue. Okay. We'll take the L. It's okay. We've got some heal gems as well. Hopefully, just one big move here by Dolph Ziggler should be enough to get the win. If I can get a quick finisher up, done. I don't care if I lose Dolph Ziggler at this point. Now, oh, this is perfect. Absolutely perfect. There you go. <laughs> I told you, one big move and he's done. One, two, three. Nice. Love it. Not going to get anything for it, but you know what? I'm not bothered. He looks so happy. He looks so happy on this. He's just like, yeah, I won. I beat The Undertaker. And I'm going to get my ass kicked in the next match. He is literally just going to be thrown in there for, for, for me. The Dolph Ziggler is going to get killed by Rusev. I, don't, I can't imagine Rusev um, being beaten by Dolph Ziggler. But he's got to be like 2,000. Not far off. 1,904. We're going to finish off this round of Gold the Blitz. Uh, start another one afterwards. I'm going to show you uh, tips for building a squad. If you haven't seen that video, by the way, go check it out because I actually made a video last week that talks about how to build the best Gauntlet Blitz team, and that is exactly what I'm using for this Gauntlet Blitz team here. So it's definitely worth your time to go and check that out. Yeah, I don't have much of a choice here. I, I kind of have to use the finisher. I'll tell you what, 
Let's use the Fuji special again. Let's see if the Fuji special does something. No. That 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 kind of sucks. Fuji special again. Okay, let's go for the tax season and let's break some loot gem off the board. There's something. Okay. I'm looking for reds. If I can get a couple of reds here, I might be able to do more damage. I might be able to pin him and not have to use any other superstars. So let's shuffle some more gems on the board. Oh, you're trolling me right now. Come on, champions. Don't troll me. Okay. Let's shuffle some more. Okay, so there's some purples. If I can get this right, running corner splash. I'm trying to save this so I don't have to use another superstar. More reds in the wrong freaking area. This is annoying. Okay, come on. Come on, champions. Give me give me a break. Give me some reds. Oh, yo. There's one. Oh, there we go. I didn't want to pin him. I just screwed myself. Oh, actually, I might not have. No, I have not screwed myself. Okay, we're okay. We're okay. We can use the rapid elbow drops. The finisher. We're going to hopefully do as much damage as possible with this. This is going to take out a couple of lines. Anything? No, it's not enough. 4,000. I don't think it's going to be enough. No. Rusev's about to kill us. <laughs> Rusev, Machka. Um, yeah. Machka. You did well, Ziggler. We did enough damage to probably be able to beat him with... And in fairness, given he's a weaker superstar to Rusev, the props helped us out a hell of a lot. Okay, so let's go back for Rusev. It's okay, we use Bubba Ray. We use Bubba Ray. It's no problem. We're going to be able to beat him anyway, regardless what happens. There's no way that he's going to be able to beat us. God damn, he's taking out a few rows here. He's going to go for a pin. Okay, uh, he's done a lot of damage here. I don't think I can get out of this. I don't honestly think I can get out of this. Uh, no, I'm 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 pretty screwed. I'm confident I'm pretty screwed. Oh no, we're okay. I think we're okay. Diving splash. Boom. Down he goes. And yes, a row of yellows. Absolutely perfect. Okay. All we need is one big move here, and he's done. One big move, and he's done. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to break three random loot gems off the board. Oh! One, two, well, that was anticlimactic. Dual star superstar coins. We can't use those because we're only on 6,000 of those. But we can open a pack. And that's important. Before we get a pack, we do have a guaranteed double gold star superstar to get. Another Golden Blitz is done. 10,238 earned. Uh, well, if you want to question the uh, champions, if anyone from champions is watching this, so how would you get to tier 2 or 3 to get better rewards throughout the game mode? Because I would have thought that with Hell Mode, because it's really difficult, it would be easy to rank up, but apparently not. Uh, but anyway, guaranteed 2-star gold superstar from Shane McMahon's money bags. The payday bag. This, if you've got the option of getting it, you get it. And guaranteed a dual gold star superstar. Plus, you get cash and coins in every single one. Now, the cash and coins isn't really worth it unless you're just kind of saving up to get yourself some packs. Uh, there's uh, 2,000 coins and 50 cash. That's decent, but what I'm after from it is this. The Mr. Wonderful Paul Orndorff. This card is going to make my deck so much better. Uh, he's going to be useful in Gauntlet Blitz. I'll say that much. So let's find him. Where is he? Paul Orndorff. Where is he? I can't find him. Um, I was completely missing his face. There he is. Paul Orndorff, Mr. Wonderful. Another dual gold superstar. Courtesy of Shane McMahon's payday bags. Guaranteed. So I've just got myself an amazing, amazing card. Recruited. Thank you very much, Mr. Wonderful. If anyone can say in the comment section how the Im immobilizing gems work, because I've never used those. Um, and we're going to level up Paul Orndorff to over 600. There we go. Okay. He'll be useful for Gauntlet Blitz. I'm, I'll say that much now. Okay. 
Uh, Taker's maxed out. I can't really do much of him until I've got all those little items. A little tiny pack opening. I reckon we can do that. Premium superstar. The chance of two-star gold superstar. Uh, which obviously is DDP. We're not going to get that. It's highly unlikely we're going to get that. Let's be honest. Okay. And you've got the giant. You've got Rusev as well. Uh, there's a few people we can go for. But you know what? I'm just hoping we get something which is good training points. 400 chips here right now. Let's open it up. What do we get? It's a bronze. Gold. Sorry. I obviously can't see. And it's a big show. Which is absolutely useless. Nice one. Thanks, Big Show. I can't complain too much. But you know what? We've got 400 cash. And 400 cash is enough to open one of these bad boys. Which we're going to do right now. Let's see. Do we get something good in this one? Because the last one was a bit, was a bit trashy. And make a superstar pack. Let's go! It's a go. I don't know why I get hyped for this. That... That... that that's terrible. He's not even useful. Wow. Champions, why do you do this to me every time I open up a... Every time I open a pack. It's like... If I earned it, I get worse stuff than if I buy it myself. Maybe I'll actually get something good from when I get my two-star premium chips, but... That's garbage. That's that's hot garbage. The team I was building last time, and they got me for it really, really, really easily. There we go. Straight away, you got that Kalisto. You got 1,400 uh, superstar there, so a little bit higher. Use uh, Dolph Ziggler, part two of Zigception. I'm going to start my next Gorton the Blitz for 125 Gorton the Blitz tickets. People have been asking me all week, how do you get Gorton the Blitz tickets? Just be in a faction. That's it. Be in a faction. You don't have to do anything else. Just be in a faction. And that's it. Thank you so much for watching. Remember to leave a like on this video if you like what you saw. Hit the description below to check out details to Twitch, Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. And my player.me account, which is something I've just put new in there as well. And also do not forget to subscribe using the little link that's going to be just down here. Across the screen is going to be different videos you can check out for me. Otherwise, one last thing, and that is to... Zoomf!